it's really doesn't say good things about what this next election is going to be about. We're learning more about the altercation between Minister Abi Khan and NDP leader Wab Kanu after surveillance video of the incident inside the Manitoba Legislature has been released. The incident occurred on April 13th during a ceremony marking Manitoba's first Turban Day. In the video, which doesn't have audio, Khan can be seen shaking Canoe's hand and is seen pulling Khan back in as he tries to walk away. The conversation continues before Khan leaves. Khan alleges Canoe used multiple curses, insults and concluded the exchange with a physical shove to his stomach. A provincial spokesperson tells City News that Khan stands by what he alleges. In a statement, the NDP says Khan lied, quote, video evidence proves he lied about a serious accusation. That's wrong and it was a desperate attempt to distract by the PCs from their health care cuts. Political analyst Shannon Sampert is worried people will be discouraged voting in the upcoming October election if incidents like this continue throughout the election campaign. When you have this kind of foolishness, people just say everybody is an idiot and I don't want to support anyone and, and they just don't pay attention. And really, who can blame them? We have to get beyond that if we actually want a province that's going to do well. University of Winnipeg professor Malcolm Bird says incidents like these take time and energy away from real issues and problems that the provincial government needs to fix. Issues like crime, health care and inflation. I think our elected officials need to focus on resolving those issues and, and talking about them and discussing them because um, there, there's a lot of, of pain and suffering uh, in, in our society right now. Bird wants to see more respectful dialogue, particularly among elected officials. And we need to have honest and open discussions with each other, particularly when we have differences. Myrna Dreger, Speaker of the House in the Manitoba Legislature, says she was unable to rule on the matter as it happened outside the chamber walls, but she had some choice words Wednesday for all members in the House. I wish that you could all treat each other respectfully and honourably. I cannot count how many times I have stood in this spot and asked members to do better in your interactions with one another. In Winnipeg, Alex Carpacity News.